Hi, welcome to this commented gameplay video of Another Fisherman's Tale. I'm Alexis Moroz, game director of the game. And I'm Balthazar Oxiet, creative director at Inner Space. Our hero Bob has been imprisoned in the hold of a pirate boat. We wanted to show you this part because it captures the concept of the gameplay really well. It shows how the different mechanics work together to create something really cool you can only do in VR. First of all, like a true escapologist, we need to free at least one of our hand to get out of this jam. Like a little spider, the player can make Bob's hand go anywhere they want. You can do multiple things here. If we open this cage, our body will technically be free, but it won't go very far without legs. Okay, so let's go and grab those legs over there. All set to move around. Without a red, though, this body works a bit like a drone cancellar. Controlling this body feels a bit like a mix between third person and third person gameplay, as you move your real hands in front of you to grab stuff. Like this key. Yes, it can be a bit tricky to control your body from this point of view. But this is part of the challenge. Now we can retrieve the crab claw that is locked up in this small cage. In another fisherman's tale, Bob can use a variety of appendages to accomplish different tasks. You'll even have crazier ones later in the game. But this crab claw is exactly what we need to cut this rope and release our own head from up there. Ta-da! Free and whole at last. But we're not out of the wood quite yet. The door to the hold is locked from the other side, of course. But that's no problem for Bob and all his detachable body parts. First, we throw our head through there to have a better view. And then our hand can follow to unlock this door. making progress, but now we're facing a secret passage locked by two keyholes in this spare part box. You can find the old head from Bob. As we can see, it has a key attached to the neck. It will go nicely in one of those locks, but we still need a second key. We may find a second key inside another of Bob's head, like our own. Let's try. Okay. Doors open. This puzzle is actually a tutorial of sort to introduce the key property of Bob's head. It will be used quite often later. And so here we are, out of the pirate's boat for a bit, and inside a huge basement. Another reality, maybe. Well, this is something to discover by yourself in another fisherman's tale. That's it for us, guys. We hope you'll have as much fun playing the game we had making it. Cheers. Cheers.